like it because it started to rain. Afternoon in the fall. This weather always makes me think about it all. The woman across me, she's wearing a Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you're here and I'm so glad you clicked on today's video. You already know what we are doing by the title of this. Are you guys sick of bookstore vlogs? Because I'm not. I feel like I could go to the bookstore every single day and never get sick of it. I don't know if that's just me or if everyone feels the same way, but that's how I'm feeling right now. And that's what we're doing today. We are going to be doing a little bookstore date together at Barnes & Noble. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but you can probably see it outside the window here. It is is such a rainy, cold, gloomy type of day in New York. I thought, why not go to Barnes & Noble and have ourselves a cutie little day? It was actually snowing this morning, <laughs> which was a little concerning. Do I have to pull out like my winter jacket and my winter boots? Because there's literally snow on the ground. I thought we'd have ourselves a cutie little bookstore date today, go into Barnes & Noble, see what's going on, see what's new, see what's hot, what's not, what's popping on the book talk table. I do get occasional comments on my videos that are like she only talks about book talk books and blah 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 blah. I genuinely enjoy those types of books so that's why I talk about them on my channel. Book talk is good. There's no reason to hate on book talk and what other people like to read. At the end of the day whatever makes you happy makes you happy and book talk books just so happen to make me happy. <laughs> okay rant over. So you guys already know the routine. We're gonna go into Barnes and Noble. We're gonna scope out the area. Check out all the new books and stuff like that. I'm at one of my OG Barnes in Nobles today and I'm super excited because it's like the Barnes and Noble I basically grew up going to when I was super young and I always like to make the little road trip out here to go to it. I'm super super excited. As for books I have on my radar today I don't really know. I do have one book that is on my radar and it happens to be the second book in the Harry Potter series, which is Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I am looking for a special edition book of it. It's like a pop-up illustrated version. It's absolutely gorgeous. I have book one and book three at home, but I haven't been able to find book two for some reason. So I thought we'd try and see if we can find it here today. With that being said though, you guys can probably guess what's coming later on in October on my channel. We are doing a Harry Potter reading vlog. I am so stinking excited for it because I'm actually like an OG Harry Potter girly. I grew up loving Harry Potter, going to the movie premieres with my sister, dressing up in the robes. I love Harry Potter World at Universal. I read the books when I was younger. I've seen all the movies. When so many of you had requested a Harry Potter vlog on my channel, I was like, oh, okay, we can do that, no problem. I do have like the OG paperback versions. Before the reading vlog, I thought I would actually upgrade my collection, get the pop-up illustrated version because they look so fun and exciting. I wanted to get a second set of them, so so I decided to go with those. They're just really, really cool and I'm so excited to do the vlog for you guys. I've definitely been stalling. I was hoping the rain would kind of calm down, but it's just not calming down. So I don't know what we're going to do. I think I'm gonna try and move closer. That's the first thing we're gonna try and do. The rain is also kind of ruining all my plans for spooky season. I have so many things I wanna do that involve me being outside and I can't be outside if it's just raining all the time. Okay, this is actually a really close spot. <laughs> this is as close as I will probably get. Making it work, making it work. Gosh, why am I so bad at parking? I'll tell you guys why. It's because I don't drive often. <laughs> I don't drive often because I don't like to leave my home often. <laughs> That's just the life of an introvert, believe it or not. Okay guys, so we are gonna head in. We're gonna try and run as fast as we can. I wish I had an umbrella. I think I do have one. I have an umbrella. We are using this baby. Yep, works out. We're gonna forget about the umbrella.
almost at the downtown stop. I'm already late, but I don't wanna get up. Outside the city's painted gray, mm, but in here a vivid world is on display. The man behind me, he carries a suitcase, a custom cut suit, but shadows on his. Just a bad day. Will he laugh when he gets home, or did it all go astray? And now he sleeps alone. I don't know where he's going. I don't even know his name. I don't know if his life has been a breeze or a hurricane. I don't know if he's happy or if all he knows is pain. But I do know that our fates have intertwined. For a moment on a train, how many timelines collide inside these walls? How many good times and tear-soaked phone calls? Decades of living, a multiverse ballet.、Uh -huh. But the earth just keeps spinning, and tomorrow all of these seats will be filled with new faces. Anyway, they won't know. They won't even know my name. They won't know if my life has been a breeze or a hurricane. They won't know that I sit here writing verses of their pain. But they will know that our fates have intertwined for a moment on a train. Hey guys, we just got out of Barnes, and I am actually really happy with the things I picked up. I only picked up two books and one like little house decor product, which I am so excited to share with you because it is so stinking cute. We are gonna do a little book haul now. I am so excited. I also stopped at the cafe. I always stop at the cafe to get a drink and like a cookie after shopping because I just can't help myself. We are gonna do our little haul, and I'm gonna start with. The house product I got, guys. This is the cutest thing I own. I picked up this cutie little book face, and it's Pride and Prejudice by Jane Austen, and it's exactly what it sounds like. It's a book face for flowers. So the inside here is hollow, so I can put water and flowers in there. But the rest of it looks just like a book, and I think it is so cute. I even like that it has like the little ridges for the pages here. I just think this is so stinking cute. I'm so happy I found it. On the back, it just says I. Claire, after all, there is no enjoyment like reading. If you're an OG on my channel, you know I'm an Austin girly, so this was so special and exciting for me to find. It was $28, which I feel like is pricey, but at the same time, it's a glass flower vase and it's themed as a book. So moving on to our books, which I know is what you guys are excited about. First book I picked up is Throne of the Fallen by Carrie Menescalo. I was not planning on getting this. I think this was on like their new release table or something. Thing. And so I started flipping through it and I read the little blurb inside to see what it was all about And I was like, oh my gosh, this book is actually getting me right now So I decided to pick it up. The dedication is also what got me It says for those who can't help falling for the villain and love a sinfully wicked fairy tale. This one's for you Say no more. You got me, Carrie. I'm kind of nervous because I don't know how it's gonna go. I don't know if I'm gonna like it, but it sounds like a really fun fantasy book that I would really like. So I decided to try it out. It's also a Barnes and Noble exclusive edition, so there's special content inside. I don't know if this cover is specific for Barnes and Noble or if it's like the same cover at every bookstore, but I also thought the cover was absolutely stunning. And when you open it up, it gives you a map of the world. I'm curious to know, and maybe you guys can help me out with this. I'm curious to know. If this is in the same universe as our Kingdom of the Wicked series, because I also have that series at home that I've been actually waiting for the winter time to read, so we're actually creeping up on the time where I'm going to start that series. I'm wondering if it's part of the same universe because it kind of seems like it is, but I don't know for sure. I'm very, very lucky and happy about this, but I was able to find Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. They had this book and so many other copies. I actually feel like this Barnes and Noble has the best Harry Potter section I. 
I've been to when it comes to going to Barnes. I feel like their Harry Potter section is just top tier incredible. It's so many things. They had puzzles, painting, stuffed animals, backpack, and just all this Harry Potter related stuff. I just thought it was really cool and fun. But they did have book two and I picked it up. I'm so, so excited. There is so much that goes in to these editions. I mean, the artwork in them is absolutely beautiful. There's also parts of the book that pop out. But these are the two books that I picked up today at Barnes. I'm so excited about them. If you guys have seen my previous bookstore vlogs, you know that we usually go all out. We go crazy when we go book shopping. I buy a lot of books, but I've actually been like pretty good when we've gone book shopping lately. I try to keep it to like three books max. Those are all the things I got from Barnes. We got two really fun fantasy books and then one adorable flower vase. I cannot wait to set up when we get home. That is all for today's little bookstore vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you had fun. Don't forget to comment down below if you'd like to see a spoiler reading vlog for Harry Potter or a spoiler free reading vlog for Harry Potter because I'm going to be starting that very very soon so let me know down below what you guys want to see I could always do a spoiler free reading vlog and then a spoiler section at the very end so maybe that's like something we could do I don't know you guys let me know what you want to see from me and we will do just that but thank you so so much for coming along with me today I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you in my next video Afternoon on a drive I only took it because it started rain Afternoon in the fall